Hey everyone, welcome back to another cleaning video. Today we have a ton of cleaning that we need to get done. My house was pretty messy, as most of you know. I did just have a baby girl a few weeks ago. When I filmed this video, she was right around two weeks old. Elvis was getting ready to go back to work, so we knew we needed to get the house picked up. So I hope you guys enjoy today's video, and if you enjoy longer videos, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. But let's go ahead and just get right into it. All right, so first we are starting out in the kitchen. I knew that the kitchen and living area was going to take me the most time. I had been trying to keep up with my bedroom, but I had let these areas completely go for the last few weeks. Elvis and the kids had been doing um, a good job of just keeping it picked up, but I definitely have a lot of areas that I actually need to get cleaned. But I did not do all this cleaning in one day. I did it over the period of two days and I took lots of breaks and I even went into the evening time just whenever the baby was sleeping I was getting my cleaning done but once I did finish with the kitchen and living area y'all I was so surprised that it happened all so fast because when I was pregnant I was the slowest cleaner like in the world it would take me forever just to clean the kitchen and the living area but I think just to clean these areas it probably took me about an hour and a half to two hours whereas when I was pregnant it probably would have taken me at least three hours to finish we could run away across the ocean Baby, what you say? We can leave today Anywhere we'll go, we'll be alright It's all about you It's all about you It's all about you So we got the kitchen picked up now we're gonna get started on these dirty dishes which of course I have a lot of dirty dishes that I need to get done I had been trying to kind of keep up on them but y'all know sometimes it just gets out of hand and you get behind on things and we just got to get it done and I do have three other kids so I am a mom of four and in our household um, I would love to just take off and rest and you know with all the postpartum things but I really have to keep up on my house or one it's going to be an issue with like my postpartum um, like recovery because I have had some anxiety and um, some depression in the past and I just feel like keeping up on my house really helps me not um, fall into that so I was feeling good this day and I was ready to get up and start doing some things and Elvis has been a huge help while he was off he was actually outside cleaning and doing like the windows and things like that you guys will see him in a little bit uh, further into the video and he's also been helping me with laundry and I would much rather do cleaning than keep up with the laundry so I was really appreciative of all his help The sink was in desperate need of a really good clean, so I am going to use the soft scrub with bleach. I'm going to scrub it, let it sit for a while. We're gonna go and clean some other areas. We're gonna clean the stainless steel appliances, and then we're gonna come back and clean the sink out.
I'm using the Wayman Stainless Steel Cleaner to clean the appliances. Dear returning viewer, thank you so much for being here today. I have missed you guys, so make sure to say hi in the comments. And I just want to say thank you to everybody for all the sweet messages that you have left on my community post and in my first story video. And if you're new, welcome. I'm Julianne. I'm a stay-at-home mom of four. I have three girls and a one little boy, all ranging through the ages of nine all the way to newborn. I make a ton of cleaning content on my channel. I also love to to do some holiday decor inspiration and just typical um, decor inspiration so if you guys enjoy that type of content make sure to hit that subscribe button and say hi in the comments Now we're coming back to the sink. We're gonna just rinse it out. It looks so much better. I'm telling you, if y'all have a white sink, the Sub Scrub with bleach is the best product that I have found that gets rid of all the stains in my sink. It just works really, really well. Maybe I'm just too weak. Maybe I'm just afraid of being alone. Well, I don't care, cause right now I feel the love that we said we would burn. I know that you feel it too I know that I told you To clean the countertops, I am using the Blue Land all-purpose cleaner. So this is 27 It doesn't matter what I've been through I should go out 
missed my fall clean and decorate i'll make sure to link that video in the description box below that way you guys can check it out i am going to be changing things up a little bit today and then i need to make my way to the store at some point because i do have a few more things that i would like to add to the kitchen um, you guys had given me some great suggestions about what I could do differently and the vase that I'm going to be putting on the kitchen table. You guys will see that in a few minutes. So I do want to run to Hobby Lobby and um, get some new florals to put in there. And then I also want to add something onto the kitchen island. All right, so we got the kitchen nice and cleaned up. There's Elvis wiping down the windows. Now I'm going to be lighting one of my favorite candles. I picked this one up from Kirkland's. It's the pumpkin gingerbread and y'all it smells so good. So this is 27. Start the music, kill the silence. Let my mind so as much as I love the table setup, I think that it is beautiful. I had some plates out here, I decided to put those away, but also just too much decor, y'all. It just stresses me out. So I needed to get this off. I need to get my table wiped down, get it cleaned up. And I am looking rough in this video. As I'm watching it back, I look so tired and uh, yeah, y'all are just here to see me clean. I know none of you guys care, but obviously after you have a baby, you're a little bit self-conscious about your appearance and watching this back, I am just feeling definitely self-conscious. <laughs> Now we're moving into the living room and I'm not gonna lie y'all, I have been letting Camila keep her toys out here. They keep her entertained. She is one of my kids who constantly just plays by herself, is really, really good about that. And she'll sit at her little table and draw and color. Um, so your house does not need to be perfect. If you have kids, leave the toys out. You don't need to put them all away. The majority of people who are coming into your house, they don't care about the toys. Be someone you love and it gets me dumb um, Yeah, I had you where I wanted you Had you by my side it was all I ever needed But couldn't realize I don't know how it feels to Be someone you love and it gets me dumb I let it slip somehow This rug is so dirty. I need to get out my carpet shampooer. I need to get it cleaned. It is just really gross right now, but it also just has stains on it. It's super old and I am gonna be getting a new one. I've been looking online and I think I found the one that I do want to get. We have had this one for a really long time and I love the way it looks. So I will definitely be getting something that is very similar. Like an overdose, you're the antidote Losing sleep, I'm in too deep No matter where I hide, you got me sleep deprived You're the 
am going to quickly vacuum and mop. I have not mopped my floors in I don't even know how long. They were pretty disgusting. So we are gonna get that done. Then I'm gonna be taking a little bit of a break because I need to get the baby out, take care of her. We're gonna go grab some lunch and then I'll be back later in the evening while the girls are taking a little bit of a nap. I am using Fabuloso to mop. All right, so now I'm gonna be getting Sophia out and y'all, she has been loving the swing. I did have um, my other two kids who did not like the swing at all. They preferred a bouncer, but I am so happy that my mom got the swing for me because it has been a lifesaver.
I don't know about you guys, but seeing tiny little babies stretch is just one of the cutest things and their little tiny feet and toes are just so adorable. We grabbed some lunch at a local place here where we live at and then we stopped over by this place called The Coffee Shop and y'all, they have the best scones. They're really, really good. The girls were so tired by the time that we got back. They are taking a nap, so I am going to get the bedroom picked up, which isn't terrible, but here I have some diapers that I need to get thrown away, some other trash, and then just really have some things that I need to pick up and get some things wiped down. But who are we kidding, kidding? We can't pretend that we feel nothing And keep it hidden now Cause I've been thinking about crossing the line And just giving, can I feel it the way I do? Uh-huh Cause I've been thinking about you all the time Thinking it out So we do live in Arizona and everything gets just so dusty here. If you do not dust every week, I mean, my room just gets gross. I had piled some stuff up in this chair. I wanted to get it cleaned out because I did want to be able to feed the baby and rock her here. I picked up this organizer from Amazon and it has been one of my favorite things to have. I just put the baby's diapers in here, some wipes and um, some extra clothes. It has been great having at nighttime.
I had taken my duvet off the bed, so I am going to get that thrown in the washer, and then I'm going to be removing the sheets once Camila wakes up. Me was all you tried when you were around. I've been told too many times now. Yeah, loving me was all you tried when you were around. I've been told to make the girls were starting to wake up so I decided I was going to quickly vacuum and honestly Sophia loves the sound of the vacuum. Whenever she is upset I will just get the vacuum out and start vacuuming while I'm holding her and she loves it. I do have an extra white sheet. I am going to be getting that put on. As you guys can see, it's super wrinkly, so I am going to be using this downy wrinkle release. Now that we're finished with the bedroom, we are going to be coming into the bathroom, which as you guys can see, it's a complete mess. We have a lot of work we need to get done in here.
Drown yourself in the neon You came to this place to hide away in the dark You tell yourself you need to move on But when not in the shadows can ease your broken heart I really need to get the bathtub cleaned out and I also need to get the shower clean. I am going to be using this bleach gel and then I picked up um, one of those scrubbers from Target that has the long hand. I know I'm late to the game on this one, but I love it. If you guys don't have one, I highly suggest getting one. To clean the glass, I am using the Dawn Power Wash, and then again, I'm going to be using that gel bleach cleaner. This way, but it's not that easy. You're complicating things for me. No, it's not that easy. Maybe just a little time can heal me, but it doesn't feel the way. What are you doing to me? Why'd you break my heart? Owen's room isn't terrible. I am just going to get it picked up and wipe it down. I just want to get it looking nice in here. I hope you'll come back to me. Yeah, I'm just that stupid. Thought that we were meant to be. Yeah, I'm just that stupid. Maybe just a little time can make you change your mind about us. I thought that we 
we were meant to be So the last place we're going to be cleaning is the kids bathroom today. I am just going to quickly get it wiped down and get it cleaned. Get the Russian, heaven on the guys that is pretty much it for today i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to give it a like and if you haven't already hit that subscribe button for more cleaning motivation thank you guys so much for being here today and i will see you in the next one bye